man, 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 man. Salute y'all. How y'all feeling? Back with another one, another one. Hope y'all feeling fine out there. Hope y'all feeling great. Hope y'all not going through with this guy's apparently went through. Man. Yo, I appreciate all the support. I can't curse yet. You know, YouTube policies, you can't do too much, I don't think, anymore. You know? But, um, salute to you guys, man. The support has been crazy, man. I just appreciate it, man. You know what I'm saying? If you ain't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe. You know what I'm saying? If you want to get a good laugh in, huh? It's like, nah, I don't know if you're laughing or not. I hope you laugh. Shit. Man, look, man, hit that thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell, I guess, so when I drop a video, you know. I drop videos like every single day. May I confuse something for the G and I drop like three videos like every single day. Now nah, I try though, man. I be working hard, man. Oh, man. Help me get them subscribers kind of, man. Help me get up to 5K. Think we can get to 5K? Shit, I need to get to 3K first, huh? huh? Help me get to 5K. Then we go go to 10K. Then we go go to 20K. We're going to get that 100K plaque, man. I got, a, I got a spot for it over here on the wall somewhere, B. Yo, let's get into this, though, man, real quick. I don't want to hold y'all all day. You know what I'm saying? I want to keep y'all all day. Even though I do, but I don't. Can't be selfish, you know what I'm saying? But this dude said, let's see what he says. I just pulled up to the Comfort Inn Hotel. Mm -hmm. I don't even know what to do right now. Like, this, this is crazy, but I pulled up here, and I'm going to tell y'all why I did this. My wife of four years is in this hotel right now and she don't have a clue that I'm out here. The thing is, she's been on OnlyFans for a while now. I didn't know, I had no clue. I didn't know, I had no clue that this is what she was doing. But she about to find out today. The reason I found out is because my homie, he got an OnlyFans. Well, he don't have one, but he be on OnlyFans. And he runs across my wife's page and he tells me that my wife has an OnlyFans. So I'm like, what? Wow. So every day she's coming home. She's acting regular. She doesn't know that I even know this yet. So what I did is made a fake OnlyFans page. And I made my name D-Rock on there. You know, I made my name D-Rock. And she don't know what's going on. I don't have an OnlyFans. I never been on OnlyFans. But I've obviously I've heard about it. I know about it. I, I know they say that you uh, I thought it was a business. I thought it's like business or it was like for like pictures and shit. So you could use OnlyFans to meet up with people. <gasps> That's crazy. Oh, what's up? How you doing, man? You all right? No, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. So she don't know what's going on. I made a fake page. Right? I made a fake page on OnlyFans. I'm sorry, y'all, but I made a fake page on OnlyFans and been talking to her for a week on OnlyFans. And I made my name D-Rock. So she's thinking she's doing a meetup with a guy named D-Rock. And it's me the whole time. So she's been hiding and having this OnlyFans the entire time. And the whole time, she's been telling me, like, when she's gone and she's doing stuff like that, I'm thinking that she's handling business, you know what I mean? Work business, work meetings, hanging out with her friends and stuff like that. When she's going for hours at a time, I'm not overthinking it. Whole time she has OnlyFans. So I made her OnlyFans. And we've been talking for a week on OnlyFans, right? And she don't know. So she just gave me a room number and everything. And, oh, here you go. She Yo, that's foul, your wife? Like, you just can't just show pictures and show your OnlyFans, you gotta do meetups? And then you, 
and you meeting up with niggas, man, and you've been talking to the dude for a whole week, and then you come at home every day like shit is normal. Y'all married four years. I would be pissed if you had the OnlyFans and you was just showing pictures and you wasn't even kicking it with nobody. It'd be an issue. I'd be ready. We gonna break up. She gave me room number and everything, and she does not know that I am coming to this door. So, with that being said, I'm finna bust it, and I'm not doing it no more because it don't make no sense. It don't make no sense. It don't make no sense. Look at that, and she don't even know. Look at that. Exactly. Uh -uh. Open the uh -uh. No. Caught. Open the no. Open the no. Open the no. Open the Whoa, 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 time out. So you see your husband and you don't even try to let it in? You try to slam the door on your husband? Your husband of four years. You just try to slam the door on. Yo, that's foul. That's foul. It don't make no sense. Look at that. And she don't even know. Look at that. Exactly. And look how she dressed. She dressed for the mess. All too impressed. Ready to get undressed. Ready to do her best. What am I doing? What is you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? You doing meetups? No. You doing me? I'm not. What you doing? Meet us. No, I'm not. What you doing? I'm not stupid. I'm not stupid. No, I'm not stupid. I'm D-Rock. I'm, I'm D-Rock. Don't stop. Stop playing. I'm D-Rock. You know, uh, yeah, but you know now. You didn't know. You, right. That's who that's. I'm D-Rock, the one you've been DMing on OnlyFans for the past week. Look. How much she charging for this shit? Niggas is paying for that? She got the whole BBL and all. I know it's a lot of people that like that BBL shit. Yo, but you married? You doing meetups? You better be charging an arm and a leg. This shit, man. I'm sitting at the house the day when she's talking about, oh, I'm business meetings or I'm hanging with my friends. You do a meetup. There's nothing to explain. There's nothing to explain. You and the... Man, I don't give a about no more. Hey, listen. I'm not trying to hear none of them. Excuse me. You and this motherfucker in a whole fucking bikini or some shit it's about to try, try to do meetups. What the fuck are you doing? Let me ask you. What are you doing with these meetups? Because you didn't know this was me. That's me you've been talking to for this whole past week. You been coming. Listen. Coming home, you been. I'm not trying to hear none of that shit. You been coming to the. I'm not trying to hear none of that shit. You been coming home, laying in the bed with me, acting about none of that crime, none of that shit. You been coming home. Listen, I don't. I know you ain't trying to cry. I'm sorry. I have no sympathy. I know you ain't trying to cry. You meeting up with random dudes, yo. You meet and we marry. You sleeping in the bed with me. You coming home. I'm at the creed. Like, man, I'm home all day. Hopefully, he, he got some type of income. He's doing his thing. But I get what he's saying. Like, you meeting up with nigga? What are you doing? Look how you dressed. It's over. It ain't nothing to talk about. I got all enough evidence I need. I'm not going to have to pay nothing. No alimony. No none of that bullshit. Divorce money. None of that. I'm not going to have to pay nothing. No kid shit. Nothing. They come with me. Nothing. Nothing. He has all the evidence. And then you want to sit there and cry. What you crying for? You wouldn't have been crying if it was a real D-Rock. You wouldn't have been crying if it, if it was a real D-Rock. If I, Come on, man. You fuck with a nigga named D-Rock? You, you've been married for four years, and you're going to throw that all the way for a nigga named D-Rock. Shout out to all the D-Rocks out there, man. You been coming. You been coming. No, because that shit crazy. You be coming home every day laying with me and doing all that shit the whole time. You doing meetups and shit. No, I ain't none of that. You doing that's nasty. I, I can only think about like yo, if I'm kissing you, making love to you. I'm if we having sex, obviously we married, so I'm not using no condom or nothing. Yo, all that'd be running through my head. This is this is what I did not want to marry. This is not what I want. I didn't marry. I, this is not what I married. We've been married four years. We've been married four years. It ain't no. It's no. She said all she's doing is dancing, y'all. Go to the strip club then. Go get a job at a strip club. You can dance on video. 
You meeting in a hotel one on one just to dance? Now you insulting my intelligence now. Now you insulting my intelligence. It'd be better if you just fucking be a grown woman and just come out and tell the real the real because you caught. So, because now you insult my intelligence. You're making it worse. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? What are you talking about, man? I'm not trying to hear that shit. 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 Don't try to cover yourself up. Don't try to cover you. Cover. Why are you embarrassed? Now you wasn't embarrassed at first. You weren't embarrassed when you was on there. I don't, I don't give. Now she want to cry. I don't give about none of that crying. Just know this. You crying, but you're the one that's in a hotel half naked with a bikini on, ass out, titties. You, not me. You're the one that's meeting up with a stranger. You're the one that's meeting up with somebody named D-Rock and you're married. You're on OnlyFans. You, you was in, who paid for this hotel? You're in here. When you come on, I get your shit. I should be crying. I'm the one that should be fucking on the fucking ground, rolling on the bed crying. Me. I know I love you shit. I know I love you shit. You don't fucking love me. You don't love me. You don't love me. You don't love me. You don't love me. Back away from me. Like, back away from me. Back away from me. Back away from me. I ain't no dear shit. You doing a whole, you doing a meetup. You got only fans, you doing meetups. You got only fans, you no. Don't touch, Katrina, don't touch me. You got only fans, you doing meetups all the time. Now you want to cry and do all that shit. No, I can't with you. So just whatever, do it. Listen, listen. Finish doing what you want to sit there. Finish doing what you was doing. Finish doing what you was doing. Well, about what you thought you about. You call the next thing, but well, come get your shit. Your shit will be outside when you come home. No, your shit will be. Kids. Don't, don't, I don't give a about none of that. I don't give a about none of that. I don't even give a about kids. See? Don't do that. We got kids. You did not think about your kids when you was doing meetups in a hotel with strangers. Because for me, it's a wrap. It's a wrap. You done, you giving my nookie away. It's over. Oh, that's always going to run through my mind. It's a wrap. Ain't no coming back from that for me. I'm sorry. And I ain't even going to do you dirty, though. You can still be a mother and all that shit, but you're not. It's over between us. I can't touch you no more. Got to go. You at the house. Should I, I might not just put your shit outside, but your shit is being packed up, though. Your shit is being packed up. Get in touch with somebody. Maybe some of them dudes you was doing meetups with. I'm saying that to be smart. But if it got to be, it got to be. Kids are staying here. And then once you go do what you're doing, get settled. And then we co-parent. Simple as that. Divorce on the way. Don't leave a comment. Let me know what would y'all do. How would y'all feel? Huh? Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And we out of this joint.